What is up you guys? It's your girl Chanel Janae from Around the Way. Hey, hey. And in today's video, I'm going to do a quick review on this hair that I got from April Lace Wigs. Now, the first thing to keep in mind is that yes, as you can see from this title and the thumbnail that you clicked on, I have had this hair for two years. That is no lie, you guys. I actually went back to my email to look at my exact confirmation. This is not a lie. I purchased this hair and received the confirmation in November of 2015. Right now, it is December of 2017. And look at this hair. I have worn this hair so many times and I get compliments every single time. People think I have a new hairstyle, but it's nothing new about it. I take good care of it. I wash it. I have straightened it plenty of times. I have curled it plenty of times, styled it plenty of times. And the hair is still in perfect condition. So, before we get into how I was able to maintain this hair for this long, let's start out with the details of what I have right now. This is a lace wig. This is Indian Remy hair. The texture is Italian yakky. That's what gives it this natural look. This hair looks like someone that's natural or even somebody that has a perm that just has their hair, hair, their hair, <laughs> hair blown out. So, um, and I'll show you what, matter of fact, let me show you right now how this hair looks when it is washed and blown out right here. Right. So that's how it looks when it's blow dry. It really does look so natural. Like anybody could believe me if I, as long as I actually put this hair in correctly, you will believe that this is my hair. This looks so natural. It feels natural. The texture of it is a thick but slightly silky material. It feels like material hair. It feels like it feels like blown out hair that is pressed. And that's what it is. So, yeah. So, the closure that I have is actually a silk top closure. So, that means that the rest of the hair is actually lace, but I went with the silk top closure and my closure is a 4x4. Four four. The color I chose is medium brown. Now, the reason I I'm going to tell you the reason I originally chose this color was because I was trying to match my natural hair color. Why was I trying to match my natural hair color? I have no idea. This was actually my very first time ever purchasing a lace wig. So I'm, I was still used to purchasing hair that matched my hair color because I was having leave out. Duh, not realizing that your hair is not going to be left out. My hair is not left out anywhere. Not even the baby hair is my hair. So anyway, that's why I chose this color. But it actually is a really pretty light brown color. I really do like it. The knots are already bleached and they give you an option of cap one or cap two. And I chose cap one at first, but the customer service, they are so, the customer service was the best. I actually got an email from someone working for April Lace Wigs and she asked me, are you sure you want to go with cap one instead of cap two? And she explained to me the differences basically with cap two, it's glueless, so you don't need the glue. It comes with adjustable strings that can keep the wig nice and secure and tight. And it has the clip so that you can clip the hair in place and it won't be falling out. You know, all that good stuff. Lastly, cost. Now, I don't spend a lot on hair. Ever. 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 <laughs> I don't. One, I don't have it like that. Two, even if I had it like that, I know that I don't usually hold on to hair for a long time. I'm the type of person to get a weave and as soon as I take it out, I throw it out. So, I don't need to spend a lot of money on hair, right? April Lace Wigs do have some high priced hair, depending on what you're going for. I actually purchased my hair... Some kind of deal was going on around that time. Black Friday. Yes, that's what it was. It was in November. 
um, Black Friday. It's exactly when I bought it. They had a bomb sale going on and I took full advantage of it. Now that I don't remember how much of a discount it was, but best believe it was a discount. This hair or this wig came to a total of $240. Um, you add on tax, you add on shipping or whatever, and that's what the price was. But this wig was $240. Now, on a regular day, I could not afford no $240 of hair. I couldn't afford to pay that amount just all the time. But this was a big save. Let me make sure my necklace is all right. This was a big save. You guys, I have had this wig for two years already. And it's still going on strong, still holding on strong. So that means that I'm going to have it even longer. And I will do another review in another year just to show you guys where we are with this wig. I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit about how I maintain this wig for so long. For one, I keep it on a mannequin at all times. I don't bunch it up. I don't put it in the bag. It sits on my mannequin and I put my mannequin up in the closet shelf or something like that and let the hair hang down. That's all I do. The ends will still get tangly and messed up because I'm just having it sitting there in a, in a corner. But when I take it out, I wash my hair. This time, I took a co-wash from Shea Moisture and I just co-washed the hair, washed the hair, washed that out. Blow dried my hair and um, then I straightened it. I took my straightener and I straightened it. One thing you will notice is that my roots, check out my roots. They are a little bit darker than the rest of the hair, right? The wig didn't actually come like that. The wig came with the hair all the same color. So this light brown is the color that the roots are everywhere. But I wasn't feeling it that much. So I wanted to have a darker look at the roots and then have it come down to being lighter. So this is what I found at my near and local beauty supply store this thing is called brush in color it says hair color touch up so I guess people can use this to touch up their hair I, you probably will not be able to see this um this couldn't have been much money I literally just found this at the store and thought that this was the best idea ever because I didn't know what else I was going to do to fix this problem without having to dye the hair. So, yeah, you literally take this. It opens up and looks like mascara. Uh, and dip it into the color, of course, and rub it or wipe it or brush it where you want this color to be. And I got this in dark brown. That's the color, dark brown. And I took it and I just did like that on my roots. You can put this wherever you want the color to be a little bit darker. So that's a good little cheap, a little tip. Then what I did was I took my got to be glue or got to be ultra glue, which is a gel. It's a styling gel, but it's called got to be ultra glued. Uh, I used this for my edges. And I use my little edge brush. And that's how I achieve this look at the front. Um, I hope you can see the baby hair and see how natural the lace looks. Yeah, and... Since the knots are already bleached, that saves you so many steps. So you can see why this wig would be expensive. Trust me, this wig, but without that discount, I would not have bought because I just would not have been able to afford it. Is it worth it? 100%. Even without the discount, this wig is worth every penny that you spend. So don't think because the price is high that you shouldn't get it. Don't be afraid of the price. And this is not something I say often because I am tight with my money i will spend anybody else's money if you want to buy me a gift go on and go all out but for me i like to spend my money i don't like to spend i mean i like to save my money i don't like to spend my money at all so i am here to tell you that this hair is worth it look at the party 
I did this part. You can part, of course, it's a four by four inch, so you can part it anywhere with, throughout there, and you'll see that silk closure. My part looks very natural. I'm going to show you the back. I hope you can see how long it is. I think this is um 22 inches. So that is all I give this. I give April Lace Wigs two thumbs up. If I had any more hands and any more arms, they would get even more than two thumbs up. They are excellent to me. I love this hair. I have loved this hair for so long. I have worn this hair for my birthday one year. I have worn this hair to one of my friend's birthday one year. I'm wearing it now. So yeah, yeah, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I need to say about this hair. Um, it doesn't tangle. That's another thing that I like about this hair. It really does not tangle. Like, look at this. I mean, granted, I just did it, so of course it's not going to tangle. I literally just washed it, blow dried it, and straightened it. This hair, really, it doesn't tangle. Of course, you get regular tangles like you would in your own hair. Everybody gets tangles. Tangle free hair, like, kind of not even possible. But this hair does not tangle badly. I can put this comb through it. And it combs well. See how it gets a little bit? But that's just because this hair is thick, y'all. This hair is thick. This is really like natural hair in the flesh. So I could comb it out, brush it out, and look at this. You see them? A little bit of strands. So there's not a lot of shedding. This is actually nothing to me. Look at this. And I had this hair for two years. I done pulled on this hair. I done did so much with this hair. I'm surprised it's not bald by now. And that's all that came out. So, yeah. It doesn't tangle either it doesn't the tangle and i wouldn't even consider it hair that sheds this hair look at it i literally will get like one strand when i do stuff like that so it doesn't tangle doesn't shed it lasts for a very very long time still has its great look i will come back and show you guys how i style my hair i'll show you how it looks when it's curled with the curling iron and how it holds the curl as well so stay tuned for that if you like this video and if you like this hair as much as i do please give this video a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel please subscribe Feel free to check out the link below. You will see um, the link to April Lace Wigs. And yeah, I think that is it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you all had a great Christmas. Let's get ready for the new year. Bring this new year in with some fly hair. Maybe they have a good deal going on before the new year and all that good stuff. Hey, hey, hey. Nah, but for real. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys. See you next time.